hello and welcome back to my channel this is Gabin from design tribe and in today's video we are going to be learning how to enhance skin tones in Photoshop so looking at the image we have here today the skin tone of this subject looks a little flat and pale so what we are going to be doing now is to enhance that and we are going to be using the gradient map for that so I'm just going to load up my gradient map adjustment layer once the gradient map adjustment layer is loaded up first thing I want to do is to switch the blend mode to soft light and once soft light is selected I will now double click here and activate the gradient map settings now this is how the gradient map works you have to assign colors to depict the dark spot of your image the mid tones and the highlights so we are going to do that right away this area the left hand side of the slider depict the dark colors on your image and the right hand side depicts the highlight and we are going to create another spot in between these two which is going to depict the mid-tone colors so here we are going to click on this button and under this color we are going to assign a color that we are going to use as our dark color and here we are going to create our mid-tones we select the color that we are going to use so before we do that we are going to disable the effects at the moment so we we'll just double click on this right here open up the settings again so the colors we are seeing are the actual colors on the subject's face so here like i said earlier this depicts this denotes the dark color on the subject so i'm just going to click here and double click on this color button and I'll come to my image maybe I zoom in a little I come to my image and I'll select a dark spot on the image so this is the dark spot that I want to use for this image once I select that spot I'll just click on OK and then I'll come to the mid tones this mid part I'm going to right click below this button once I right click there I'll make sure that my location here is 50% for this one make sure your location is zero and for this one at the top make sure it's 100% so once this is set to 50% I'm going to select it and then click on this color button and I'm going to click and select the area where I think the represents the mid tones of this image so I think I'm going to select this for now yeah just select that one and I click on OK and on this other part I'm going to select the highlight area of my image so I'm just going to come here to colors and I'll select this area so you see there is a smooth transition from the dark color to the mid-tone color and up to the highlight colors so this smooth transition can only be achieved when using the gradient tool so that is why this tool is very important so once we have mapped out the colors like that and we click on ok now i can now go and enable the effects once you've enabled the effect you see the effects has enhanced the skin tones of the subject at this point the effect has been applied to the whole image but we want it to be applied only to the skin so i'm just going to select my mask layer here press ctrl i on my keyboard and i will select my brush tool make sure my foreground color is white and my brush is a soft brush I'll reduce my size like that and zoom in and paint on the skin areas of my subject once i paint on the skin areas the color is being applied to my subject so i'm just going to paint this in paint this in like this now as you paint the color may seem to be too saturated at the end we will going we are going to modify the intensity of this effect on our image so I'm just going to paint in like this so when paint doing this you have to be very patient and make sure you don't paint on non skin areas so I'm just going to paint like this reduce my brush size 
paint on this other area like this paint in here okay so let's zoom out you see the skin tone now looks a little more rich than it was before i may now want to turn it down a little this now depends on what you want to achieve so i'm just turn it down to maybe 74 percent and this is how it looked before this is how it looked after before and after so that is it for this video if you enjoyed it please do well to support me by liking and sharing this video subscribe to my channel if you are not yet a subscriber for i release these videos every single week thank you for watching see you in my next video bye bye